Bonsoir. I think a lot of bands like, you know, after time passes and you know when you're touring and it's very intense and you do this for a long time then everybody's like, whew, we gotta take a break from each other. You know, we did this for 14 years together. And then so to take six years off now, it feels really nice to be at practice with the guys and play it with shows with them. But, you know, it was really nice to have six years of no rock and roll. Okay. But it feels nice to do it again. It just happened. No one, no one decided, no one knew the last show in September 2003 in Paris that that was going to be the last show. It was just time, time for it to take a break. Like it is now, time to restart. We're just human, you know. Uh, we toured. For, we lived in a van for you know ten years together, um, but it was great, you know, to play music the whole time. Um, but it's just exhausting, physically exhausting, to to do that much. I mean, we toured over the USA, you know, sixty shows in a row and stuff like that. You know? It just it'll kill anyone, you know. Um, it's, it, and after a while, you know, it's time to you got to rest, or you're just gonna, you know you're just gonna. Whoosh, yeah, fall down. You know. If we went for the last six years, we'd all look a lot we'd be, worse than we did right destroyed. now. <laughs> it physically destroys you, you know. Or mentally and everything. Yeah, I mean, unless you're a huge band in four-star hotels or something. But we were we were sleeping in the band, you know. Uh, which, but it was it was great. But um, it's good to take a break. Troy was in town, and they said, hey, do you guys want to play some shows? Would you, would, would you be into that? And we said, sure, why not? Let's try that. So yeah. I guess it was just time or whatever, you know? It felt like it was time. It was the right timing. And um, all the three of us were in Berlin at the same time, and we started to play acoustic guitar t together. And it just felt, felt right and felt like we should continue. Anybody who knows Chopor understands Chopor music and understands uh, that w the way we do it, and, and that we did it for so long, and that we, you know, um, are very indie. People, I've, I've heard concern that they were worried that we were going to be too big and play in only big clubs and and be not be um, available to the public. There were actually, I heard that in Geneva. Really? Like, yeah, they were worried that we were going to be too big. And Something different. Yeah. Um, it's like, no, you don't have to worry about that. It's yeah. not going to happen. <laughs> you don't have to worry about it being <laughs> yeah, too popular. <laughs> <laughs>
we only practiced for what three weeks <laughs> four weeks maybe at the most yeah, we so we only had enough time just to to learn the songs that we're playing tonight and on this tour so that's the next step new songs working with the new label well, we started this. working on a couple but yeah yeah in the summer we're gonna work on new stuff more did you play some live no? yeah we're playing um some unreleased stuff yeah uh and we actually just went through our our, our music files and found lots of half written songs that we're gonna continue writing and then also just write new things you know from scratch in the summer hopefully mm -hmm. Yeah. 